Alright, today I'm going to show you guys Super Smash Brothers being played on an iPad 3 using Splashtop 2 and using an Xbox controller to control this shit. Let's get to it. I got the frames per second running on the top left corner. It'll, you'll see it runs at a constant 60 frames a second. It's pretty, pretty responsive, nice and clean. And so, classic. Said Yoshi's my favorite. I mean, there's a tiny bit of lag, but it's incredibly playable, so. Nothing too bad. You can see graphics are super clean and crisp. I'm using Dolphin Emulator again, by the way. Let's just start. Come on. Have an egg, motherfucker. Have two eggs. Uh oh. Damn. I'll play a couple of matches so you guys can kind of see how the gameplay is. I mean, as you can see on the top left corner, it's been at a constant. Oh shit, I was looking at the wrong screen. It's at a constant 60 frames a second. That's just a rap, uh, rap glare by a dolphin. No big deal. Versus Kitty Kong and Donkey Kong. And even when there's a shitload of action on the screen, still, as you can see, 60 frames a second. The lag is due to splash top and not the emulator itself. But if you do guys do try to do this in the emulator settings, make sure you pick DirectX 9, not DirectX 11, because for some reason when you stream it, it runs like shit in DirectX 11. It does it like a 30 frames a second, it's very noticeable. I mean, hopefully, here in the next couple of weeks or months, if Splash Top 2 gets updated, it'll even have less lag and thus be more playable. But I mean, honestly, shit, as you guys can see, this shit goes damn good. Sorry, I cuss a lot. I got a bit of a potty mouth. Oh, uh oh. Here with my apple. Person, I mean, but how, how awesome is this? Super Smash Brothers <laughs> running on an iPad. It's an iPad 3 too, by the way. I guess it wouldn't matter what kind of iPad it is. So, I mean, theoretically, you shouldn't even work on your iPhone or iPad mini. Go charge our gives ass. Uh oh. Oh shit. Oh, I'm an idiot. Okay, we'll do one more. And then if you guys want to try this out yourselves, feel free to email me. I'll let you guys know what settings I use and how I was able to pull this off. It was really not that hard at all. A little bit of tweaking, and that's mainly on the emulator's part. Splash Top 2, I would have the settings kind of worked into themselves so you don't have to mess with it too much. Yeah, you can use the Xbox controller, I'm sure you guys already know, you can get that, um, I bought it at Best Buy, about 50 bucks, so you can hook it up to a PC. Dude, I did it again, I'm an idiot. Oh well, big, big wolf. I'm really not that good at this game. Alright guys, well there you have it. Like I said, if you guys have any questions, feel free to email me.